A nonprofit group is focusing attention on one of the consequences of rapid growth and development in North Texas. The group is launching a program to help established residents in West Dallas keep their homes and pay their property taxes. Those taxes have quadrupled for some residents in the past seven years. Fox 4 Sean Rabb joins us with the story. Sean. Clarice, just travel west across the Margaret Hunt Hill Bridge and you'll see the explosive growth. New buildings, new businesses, new residential living, all of that driving up property values, pushing up property taxes. And for some folks who've lived there for decades, now struggling to meet those property taxes, they could be pushed out. We consider West Dallas to be ground zero for gentrification in the city. It's the area where we see the most extreme um, rise in property valuations and property taxes as well. Since 2017, property taxes in West Dallas, the 75212 zip code, have for hundreds of residents quadrupled. They were under $1,000.900 when I first started paying the taxes. Now? And now it's over 2000 A rise that began after the Margaret Hunt Hill Bridge connected West Dallas to downtown and brought new commercial and residential development. It's ironic, but also actually very predictable. This is the story of gentrification. Stephanie Champion is Community and Policy Development Officer for Builders of Hope, a nonprofit home builder creating a fund to help folks in West Dallas pay skyrocketing property taxes. This is a pilot program that we hope will pay year over year incremental tax increases for West Dallas residents, legacy residents who have lived here for over 10 years, who are really struggling to pay their property taxes. Foundations and private donors contributed. Builders of Hope also looking to those making a profit in West Dallas to help. So one of the things we are going to ask developers to do when they come in to seek any type of zoning entitlement um, or city subsidy is to ask them to give back to our community by contributing to this fund. Sofia Mosqueda says it would be a blessing for people where taxes have gone up disproportionately, but income hasn't. Just for some relief, a little bit of relief for, for our families, not just me, but everybody in this neighborhood hoping for relief and some extra support, an extra hand. To keep folks from being pushed out of their homes because they can't keep up with rising property taxes. I think the hope we have for our neighbors is that they have the right to stay and the right to choose whether to leave. Okay, it's a pilot program, but if you live in West Dallas, you can apply for the grants to help with the property taxes at the Wesley Rankin Community Center. The Wesley Rankin Community Center on Carson Street. You know, the same type of gentrification is happening across southern Dallas. This is a pilot program, but if it works and if they get the seed money they're looking for, they plan to take this to other neighborhoods. Clarice? We shall see. Sean Rab live. Thank you.